Ford Contour. It doesn't need to hold air for a long time, it just needs to hold air for a good time. Everybody, everybody hang on. Oh boy. We're gonna put doodahs on the roundy things. Oh, dude. <laughs> then go through dirt that's really moist. It's gonna make me look like an idiot. Coming? We're going. We're going. You're, gonna, you're coming with? Okay. Polo! Polo! <laughs> Look at them meats, huh? I knew I should keep those for a reason. I didn't know what, but now I got them. And I got this, I had this car and I didn't know why I should keep it. And I had these mud tires and I didn't know why I should keep it. And now I know why I should keep both of them. Cause they're meant to be. Damn. It's also a storage rack. You're fine. It's fine. Man, Marlo, you really curbed that sucker, didn't you? I think we can do her in one shot. I don't think so, but. Oh, damn near. You're hurting your daughter. Surprisingly going pretty well. Oh, not going so well. I spoke too soon. Like a glove. Man. I need a big hammer. Right here. Look at that. It's right there. I don't recommend that. I also don't recommend putting these on a Ford Contour, so. I don't, I'm like, beggars can't be choosers. It doesn't need to hold air for a long time, it just needs to hold air for a good time. Woo! Straight as a freaking rail. It's a rim, so it's round. You know what I'm talking about. Man, that looks good. I freaking do say so myself. Oh, it's gonna be a little tight. That's all right, a little tight, a little tight is not always horrible. We can deal with it. Freaking Marlo steals all the jacks. Freaking not even a jack in sight because Marlo takes all the jacks for his little four-wheeler Then he never even touches it. He hogs up all the jacks and then he doesn't even use it. Just collecting dust. Doesn't even put his tools away. For all you kids out there, if you're gonna come borrow someone's tools, at least put them away. I don't know if that's the correct spot to lift, but beggars can't be choosers. I don't know if my grandma's gonna comment or not on it, but maybe like, hey, it's in the wrong spot, Andrew. That would be a real slap in the face if she did. Old grandma Bose on there commenting, tearing me a new one. Where we going, we don't we don't need those. Oh man, wrong thing. That's a script one. See that? There's a tech tip. Got her. Try the one side first and back up a little bit. No, I mean it's fine, isn't it? I mean, it is, but I just, you know, it's always to be, you know, feel confident, but there might be that one time you back up and... Fine, Brody, fine. We'll be logical in what we do. I'm all about not, but if you say so, freaking hang out. out. Hang out with Brody, they said. He's fun. You happy now, Brody? Are you happy? Are you happier? You always gotta undercut me, man gonna make me look like an idiot out here trying to have fun and Brody's like Boo. that's not how lucky and I do it but it's always just make fun of Andrew isn't it now I got you and Zach conspiring against me you're probably in it with Marlo too aren't you I'm trying you're probably like hey Marlo you should go oh did you just see that we just folded the whole weld ah that's when you know you're working on a quality piece of equipment. Come on! That didn't work. A little detent here is kicking my butt. There we go. Nope! 
That's how I got them stuck last time. See, kids, that's what happens when you use the right size socket. Don't be a square peg in a round hole. Good advice. You know? Unless it's trendy, then, then you can. Oh, rusty. This Ling Long is not a quality tire. You know? I think they're like 30 bucks at Walmart. It's kind of like if you got a $10 head, then wear a $10 helmet. If you only value your life worth $60 in tires, then put on a $60 tire. But See that one that was on there? This one over here? He used it one time and it had a tire plug in it. What? Because it cracked like on the first day he drove it. So remember kids, your time is worth something too. Just because something's cheaper doesn't mean it's really cheaper. Okay, we gotta use science here. This tear goes in the right side, so then, yep, yeah, got it, science. Science rules. Goes like this. This, you just put this down, flip this up, then hit this button, and then you just push this. And then when this is getting pushed, it'll just push it on, and then you're on. Simple, wow. it's science. And then this one, you just you put it on, and then when it's on, you just put it on. And then once it's on, you just keep it on, and then see how bad it came off. So then it didn't stay on. You gotta back up. And then, no, then once it's on, then you just keep it on. Oh, and then, because the whole thing is when you're taking the tires on, when you're taking them on, the biggest thing is to make sure that they take on all the way. But they just, they're, they're either on or off. You just want to make sure they're on. Okay. Anyone can do tires. There. That's a happy tire. Hey, Marlo, when you're watching this, if you could just, next time you mount tires, could you clean this up a bit? Because you kind of left a mess. On there? Let's try that bottom one. Don't even start with me. Woo! Butter. cool while it lasted. Oh my god, that freaking guy on the beach in a car. What an idiot. Ready to go. Oh! Yeah. <laughs> no. 
speed on her or just? Yeah, well, all wicked. All wicked. I did my calculation right. We should make it in 10 to 15 seconds. So wait, are we buckled or not? Oh, everyone buckled to me. I am. Yeah, you should buckle. I think we're buckled. Okay, you guys ready? Give me nuts. I'm right here, but you're back your head. Okay. Everybody hang on. Oh, smart. tour it's for sale if anyone's looking and it still turns over so I think we just need some new plugs or something but this thing's pretty tough I, I think it's got some on the diplomat that's my that's about all I need for high lifter experience I think it'll polish up pretty good it needs a good coat of wax and uh, maybe a seat cover or two and she'll be probably be fine just don't don't tell my dad wreck my crystal gale t-shirt learn nothing about driving other than that it was a good day but uh, uh, that's all I got. Thanks for tuning in, guys. Uh, make sure you make it out next year for Mud Nats. It's uh, pretty fun. Oh, that guy just lost his cooler. You're, you're strapped! Uh, he'll figure it out. But uh, yeah, thanks for tuning in. Make sure you comment. You got any ideas what we should do next, what kind of cars we should junk, and all that garbage. So thanks for tuning in. Like, comment, subscribe. Appreciate you guys. See you next week.